How we doing guys, my soul Chris Petty OBE here with a quick one. Real talk, true season. There's always someone better than you. Now this is for all the young kids, because all the young kids think that you've got this on Smash. I don't care if I took up a man, man will go prison, man will do the time. It's not about doing the time as well. It's not about just sitting in a jail house like, yo, like this is calm still. Let me smoke some cheese. Let me smoke some gelato. Let me walk around on the wing like I'm a bad man. There's always someone better than you. So you can go in there for ABH. You can go in there for GBH. You can go in there for Feft. You can go in there for fraud whatever but there's always someone better than you in there check out this little post quickly of someone getting beaten up in prison and this is just something that happens every single day don't think that you're better than any man with no the man that ain't got no neck brother and he's been in there for 15 years pumping weights through where and you want to come in and try and go like you run the prison you do not run the prison there's certain men that run the prison the security can't help you the security guards can't help you then feds man can't help you when them doors lock the doors lock and you're getting tumped up but take a look at this <laughs> Hey, what did I do? Hey, cuz, what did I do? What did I do, cuz? Hey, cuz, what did I do? Say sorry now. I'm sorry. Look in the camera and say I'm sorry. Hey, cuz. Get out now. What do you do, Josh? I'll suck cuz. You suck cuz for money, innit? I'll suck cuz for money. You fucking pussy. Huh? You're fucking innit? Screaming, what did I do? What did I do? Low it, what did I do? My man went in there for robbery. Yeah? Man thought it was bad, yeah, robbery and lick down put someone's house or probably rob someone. Man's a bad man then, but man ain't a bad man in prison. Now where's where's the bad man that robbed that person? So don't always feel like you're bad and you got this on smash. This goes to show that you kids don't know prison life and some of you olders ain't showing them about prison life. I also want to show you another video. Another video of someone in prison telling you what it's about. Telling you, do you know what it's like to get 18 years? Do you know what it's like for your mum to hear you in court getting 18 years? Your life is done, your life is over. 18 years. Think about it, you can sit there all the time and you can't even sit in class for an hour. Let's keep it real. Some of you man can't even sit in class for an hour. But you wanna go on bad like and go on like you can do time. I'm telling every kid, this weekend, go into your bathroom, if you think you're bad, go into your bathroom, this weekend, lock the door and shut it and see how long you can sit in there for. That will give you a small little inkling on what it's like to be confined. You can't open the door, you gotta lock the door. Let someone lock you in and you can't get out. And let's see how long you can last in there. Let's see if you can do 24 hours. Go and, go do a little experiment. If you don't want to think that you know prison, yeah, man, no prison, I got this. Sleep in your bath. This weekend, sleep in your bath and sleep in your sleep in your toilet and get someone to bring you like some crisps and some snacks and stay in there. No TV. Yeah? You get one book. And let's see how much you man know. Yeah, man's about this life, man's about this life. But check out this post also from someone that was banged up behind bars that's doing time, that knows what it's like to do time. Take a look at this. Decide to go down this path that you're going down. Look at your mum now. Yeah, now imagine her sitting in the courts. Yeah? And hearing her son get sentenced to 18 years in prison. 20 years. These are, these are the things that you have to think, consider when you pick up a knife and you stick it in a man. Because real talk, the sentences that ain't joke, you know. Life, yeah, you know what life means? <sighs> means you're gonna sit down for 18 to 20 years. Yeah, I'm here. I'll be home soon, it's nothing, but there's a bagger man up, up and down on every landing, on every wing, wishing that they didn't pick up that knife. Wishing that they didn't stick it in there. Breaking in the it down. Showing you, do you know what it's like? Do you want to be behind them doors? You see where he was? Do you want to be behind there? Do you know what happens when you go behind that door, big man? It's over. Yeah? Right off. So when you lot are running around, and you lot ain't running around doing petty crimes. You lot ain't running around getting two months. You lot ain't running around getting three months, six months. You lot are running around doing big boy murders, getting big boy sentence. 15 years. Big boy stretch. That's you behind that door every single day for the rest of your life. For the rest of your life. No more gal, yeah? See that girlfriend Tara that you got? She's gone, fam. No more Tara, yeah? See your brethren that you every time you, yeah, man's coming around your eyes, man's gonna bang you up at fever. No more fever with your brethren, root boy. Yeah, you might have a look at 2 2 computer. You might have some rubbish little sound system or, or stereo or some phone that you gotta put up your bum. Let's keep it real. You might have always, oh, man's got a blow in there, rare, rare. When they spin your cell, where's that phone going? What, you shoving it up bum? Nah, later, I'm not banking nothing. Yeah, that's what man them call it, banking. I'm not banking nothing. I'm not pushing that end up there. That's not my life. I don't want to do that. 
you got to shit and pee inside the toilet with someone else later. Leave it. I keep telling you kids all the time. So it's funny how you think you want to glorify it. Man, get strats this man, go prison. Man, get this if I go prison. No, you're wasting your time. You're an idiot. Now you're in prison. Now you can't see your mum. Now you can't see your sister. Now you can't see your brothers. Now you can't see your girl. Now you can't see your child. You might not even have no good friends like that. You think your man them are riding for you. Your man them ain't come up to see you, big man. Man's got things to do. Man's out there in the band though, isn't it? Country, OT, you know how we get it down, family. So when you go prison and you stab someone for your crew, for the clique, for the gang, for your postcode, for your area, and then you go prison and you start realising raw, like, no man's even reaching out to man, like, man's just sitting there on my jacks. Like man didn't ride out for the my man and my, my man dropped on the floor and I ran back and made sure that I dropped my man and said, La, like, you, you can't get my bridge and like that. You went down, you're facing 18 years, your bridge is still living, got life, got gal, running around, got beer money, spending beer money, living life while you're sitting behind bars in a grey tracksuit, talking about gang, 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 man's riding my bird. You're a joke, cop off. And then when you're coming out all in your 40s, 50s, later, that's not me. So go so out of all of you kids. Take note. Take note of the first video. You're not a bad man. There's always someone better than you out there that will come and punch you up. And take note of the second video. Do you want to be banged up behind bars? Do you want to be behind that cell? Do you want your mum to see you getting 18 years and that's it? Your life is done. Your life is over. Because we keep sitting there talking about your repping something. Rep yourself. Rep the understanding that, raw. like, if I do this, then I gotta know the consequences of my actions. Know the consequences of your actions. Because I'm telling you, a lot of the times, when it actually happens, you start realising that you've made the wrong choice. Don't be like the rest of them fools, making the wrong choices. Go in prison, all for clout. Go in prison for a little strike when you can be living your life. Getting what you want. Doing what you need to do in life. You know the ones there? You might be seen as more. Oh, man's more. Man's going to college. Rare, rare. I always tell the people about my friends, bruv. You get me? That didn't go to college. You end up getting a apprenticeship, bruv. Working in a state agent, bruv, and got yourself up. Now your man's got 30 properties and two state agents, bruv. Man's doing well. So who's dead now? Who's moist now? So a lot of the time, you might people might be looking at you, oh, you're an idiot, oh, you're not moist. Oh, yeah, man's not gang, man's not gang. Oh, fuck, sir, have you ever been prison? I've never been prison. And I'm happy that I've never been prison. But there's certain people that's been prison that will tell you it's not a nice thing, bruv. You know what's there? Being isolated, being confined in a small box, bruv. You know what's there? And then when you want to act like a bag man, you're going to segregation. Do you know what that's like, bruv? 23 hour banger. Go down there, innit? And sit down. Yeah? Some people start turning crazy, bruv. Mine can't take it. Because you're just there for 23 hours, bruv. You get let out for an hour. Are you alright? And then when you get let out for an hour, you're not seeing nobody. No integrating with no inmates. Not integrating with nobody. You walk around for an hour. Some big square for an hour. And then they take you back into the cell, bruv. And that's another 23 hours. And sometimes you're down there for about two weeks. Week. Some people have been down there three weeks. Even some people have done a month. And any bad man will tell you, bruv. No one likes seg, bruv. If you go down to seg, bruv, it's a mad thing. So please, kids, man, just think about your life. Think about your parents. Thinking about the, your future. Thinking about the people that you're hanging around with. Just because you're hanging around with your boy, you know wrong from right. You know what you shouldn't be doing. You know you shouldn't be hanging on road. You know you shouldn't really be getting involved in a gang and anything. And like I keep saying, gang don't have your back, bruv, when it comes down to the end of the crunch. Everyone's screaming at gang, 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 gang. When someone dies, bruv, there's no gang then. Yeah? When someone gets deaded, there's no gang then. When someone's getting in prison, there's no gang then. Yeah? Everybody's for their self. Everybody's breezing out and leaving you. I'm seeing videos of man them getting into beef and leaving their brethren, bruv. You know what's their brethren's getting caught? Man's like, yo, fam, later, bruv. See you later. Every man's for their self. But I swear when before, when we left for the move, everyone's like, no, don't worry, bruv. Man's got your back and rare, rare. When things hit the fan, bruv, everybody's gone. You won't see no one. So please, guys, take note of this small little video. But this is what's going on within our community and we need to stand.